and welcome to this tutorial from AKCP. Today we're just going to take a look at how to very quickly set your IP address on your Security Pro base unit. So let's jump in and begin. Now the default uh, IP address of the base unit that actually ships with your Security Pro base unit uh, is 192.168.0.100 and if we type it into Google as I've done here and I click search you'll notice that Google obviously can't find that unit uh, on our network because our network settings are completely different at this moment in time to what the base unit uh, settings are so we need to rectify that so what we need to do is we need to go down to our uh, network settings at the bottom here and click open network and sharing center we're going to go to change adapter settings we're going to select our local area network and then we're going to go to properties and then we're going to go to TCP uh, 4 and click OK. Uh, click properties, sorry. And within the properties here, you can see that we have our network uh, properties uh, for our default gateway. And we need to make a note of this so that when we are entering our information in our, to our security probe unit, we have all this information handy. So I've made a note of that already. So the next thing that we need to do is we actually need to disconnect our computer from the internet and we need to connect the base unit directly to the computer. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Okay, I've now uh, connected my base unit directly to the computer and I've disconnected my computer uh, from my area network. And the first thing I uh, need to do is obviously go back into my uh, adapter settings exactly the same as I did before. I'm going to go to uh, TCP IP version 4 properties and you can see that I've already changed my IP address uh, to match that um, of what the base unit comes with. Uh, the base unit comes with 192.168.0.100 and I've changed mine to .99 uh, so uh, you need to go ahead and do that and I can click uh, cancel and I'll cancel all this off now. And now within Google I'm going to type in the IP address of the unit, the default IP which is 192.168.0.100 and click enter and straight away you can see I'm going to get redirected to my security probe 5 ES base unit. So now what I want to do is obviously change the uh, IP of this base unit. So in order to do that, I'm going to go to settings. And now within the settings, you can see in the setup menu, I've got um, a lot of options here to twirl down in general connectivity and system administrator. So we'll turn, turn down general. You can see we have the system date and time guest page. Now let's go to connectivity and under connectivity you can see we have Ethernet network so let's click there. Okay so now what we have here is we have our uh, options to change our uh, Ethernet network. Obviously your Ethernet network is going to be diff different to what mine is uh, so you need to make a note of this yourself. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the IP address uh, to what I want the unit to appear as on my network. So that's 10.1.5.147 I'm going to leave my uh, subnet mask uh, the same and as it is my gateway is also fine 10.1.5.1 I'm going to hit go ahead and click save and once I've done that the unit will then uh, make all the necessary changes uh, there you can see the system is setting up the network <coughs> okay so while that's uh, all happening I'm going to disconnect the base unit and I'm going to reconnect my computer back to the internet again. So I've now reconnected my computer to the internet and I've also reconnected my uh, base unit to my network switch. So the first thing that I need to do is go back to my uh, network center, change my adapter settings, uh, go to TCP IP version 4 again, properties, and you can see that I've already changed back my IP address to match my current network. So now that I've done that I can get rid of uh, all of these boxes here. And I can go ahead, I'll open a new window and I'll type in my new IP address which I assigned to my security probe, which is 10.1.5.147. You can see it's already come up and I'll click enter. And now you can see I've been redirected my to, to my security probe which is now showing on the network. And that is how you set your IP address uh, using your computer and the base unit.